everyone, and welcome to the channel. I'm Brad Smith, and this is the Fallout 4 playthrough. And... We're at, uh... Oh, dear. We got someone here with a radio. Oh, God. All right. Anyway, uh, I'm just uh, doing some running around. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. I just, just fell over. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Did we ever set this up? I don't think we ever did. Uh, the Starlight Theater is a place where you can set up, put up a settlement, and. Um, yeah. Although, I have an idea. <laughs> Come on. I have an idea where to put the um, the interceptor. Uh, there we go. Nice. Damn. All right. I, in fact, I think I want to put it up here. You know, Starlight wouldn't be a bad place. It does have possibilities. Okay, so let's take a look at where that. Oh. Uh, oh, Christ. Piper is back at the um, home plate. And you had a uh, deal, Trudy. Hand over the goods you owe us. I ain't giving you poison shilling chem pushers anything. Do you know what that junk has done to my boy? He bought them fair and square. You know, <sighs> never did like anyone named Wolfgang. <laughs> oh god okay hi I can't wait to see the crows feeding on that scumbag. Here, this is for you. <laughs> now, if you ever need to trade, my shop's open. Okay. You got things covered from here? Yeah. It's going to take my son a while to get off the chems, <laughs> but we'll make it. We always do. Now, let's get back to business. You need anything for the road? Yeah, let's see what you got. Let's see what you have. All salvage, but nothing's junk. Now, oh, let me take some of these. I have hundreds of bobby pins, but a few more won't hurt. Uh, 
Um, ah, sure. Oh, that's definitely not junk, but I'm not interested in that. Yeah, I was, uh, whoop. <laughs> uh, I was just thinking about Wolfgang's head exploding like that. Piper may not have liked that, but then again, that's why I kind of left her behind on this little trip. All right. There we go, Dirty. Do some business with you. This is uh, this is her son, Patrick. Hi, Patrick. 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 All right, Patrick. All right. Now, in another world, I may have shot him, but then again, that's. Oh, oh, oh. God damn it, you! Hey, hey. So what's your story? Looking to raid, rob, rob me, or just ask for direction to dine in the city? Let's see what you've done. You really don't. God, what? What's wrong with your eyes? Good lord. You pretty much have what there's something about this woman I do not like. Now, she looked a lot more like Tig Notaro. I mean, I think she's a you know, good actress and all, and I can handle her, but Trudy, I mean, the trash can Carla looks like a... <sighs> yeah, I just don't trust her. All right, okay. Okay. To save. Because sometimes this is a fallout for a game and it will drop. Okay. Well, they're still looking good over there. <sighs> okay. Hmm. Have a little bit of coffee here. Ninety-nine days to Halloween, everyone. Ninety-nine days. I never thought a reporter could consider themselves a success until someone threatened their life. Me? I'm very successful. All right, Piper. We're going on the trip. Okay. Thanks. Huh. Just a second. Hey. You say the word. I like that. Hey. Uh. 
Uh, let's see. Let's try this. Put that on fiber. Okay. How are you doing on fusion cells? Oh, it's still pretty. But then again, we can have you in this. All right. There you go. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Piper thinks it's still Halloween. And you know what? That's okay with me. Because starting tomorrow, um, I think it's going to be, uh, it's going to be uh, Christmas time in. Okay, let's check this out. It's the mod that I have, you know, it keeps up the Halloween decorations, I think, a week before Halloween. And a week or two weeks, up to two weeks after Halloween. Which is pretty much how it works in the, in, in the real world. All right, Piper. <laughs> <laughs> How's the Nuka girl outfit working for you, Piper? Okay. Hey, at least I'm not having her dressed up like as a slave girl. What's here? Oh God! This could be hit or miss. I'll check this out later. Nice to know that these computers are still working 210 years after a nuclear holocaust. Here we go. Eagles Cove Tannery. Okay, space girl. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Let's just take a look at this. Eagles Cove Tannery. Oh my god. That's... Oh god. Oh wow, that's up here. Piper, right? Uh, hey. Just let me know. Okay. Yeah, I did, and I put you in a. Let's see. Let's give you. A, there we go. I don't think, I think we have to go, oh god, what the hell, free for the taking, yep, what are rocks doing up here? Okay.
kind of hard. Is that? That's way the hell up there. All right, Piper. We got a trip ahead of us. Oh boy. This is going to be interesting. What's this? Gunners? Oh god, Viper. Good lord. Now those Pipers, I mean those uh, Gunners, still aren't very happy. All right. Oh, boy. Oh, that was fun. All right, are we going to be able to get up this way? Just in case I'm better. Save. All right. <laughs> Just a second, Piper. I got my directions turned around. Oh. Okay, we got a storm rolling in. And that's never a good thing. Like I said, the last time that happened to me, I was thrown back in time. And I really don't want to go through that again. I can't go this way? But... Wait a second. Is it this way? Eagles Cove Tannery, that was the fist pet plant where we were at. Is this? Oh. 
was a oh god. Oh well. Oh Christ Piper, we are really, really, really in unknown territory. <laughs> Is this it? So this is um nice being on the move again. More paper cuts than back home. Damn it! Come in! I know you're listening on the other end. Where oh god. Is Where is my daughter? Kenji, please. You've been at this for hours. Stop. You need sleep. She's out there, Ray. Okay. Raiders or gunners or God knows what else. Where the hell is this? Okay. Was that? Oh God! There. I thought I saw something. You know, when that rat storm hit. Shice. Oh, Piper, we got problems. Piper. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. That, uh, what the hell is that? Okay, let's just see what happens. Oh, well, that happens. Okay. All right, take a look at the map again. Common residence, but. <sighs> Did I do something wrong with the map? Okay. All right, so for some reason, <clears throat> I took the wrong turn somewhere. Okay. So this is the creamery. Okay, let's get on. Okay, that highway's not gonna be any use to us. Let's get on this way. All right. Okay.
Wait a second, is that in? Oh my god. I know where that is now. I think. No wonder I can't. Eagles Cove Tannery. I bet you anything that's in. It's in Far Harbor. I knew, yeah. Can I go ahead and take a boat? No, I can't. <laughs> Okay. Hi. Who are you? I'm sorry, but we don't have time for visitors or caravans or wherever you're from. Uh... You were shouting about a missing daughter. What happened? A good Samaritan? Fine. I'm out of options anyway, if you want to hear about it. My daughter is missing. It all started with this damn radio. Our daughter Kasumi likes to fix things. The radio was her latest project. Until she made contact with some kidnapper who lured her away from us. Or maybe she left on her own. She's not a child anymore. Our daughter is 19. She knows how to survive and she's capable. I... think maybe she left because she wanted her own life. No. She would have told us where she was going. She would have said something. I know my daughter is in danger. I can feel it. Find her, please. Okay. Do you have any idea where she could have gone? We know she took one of the boats, but that's all. She could be anywhere. I'll find her. Don't you worry. Thank you. Her room is upstairs, if that helps. And if you had any more questions about her, just ask. Okay.
Yeah, you know, I have to say that I, I wish they would um, you know it, it's a few hundred years after the apocalypse and not everyone would be li living in something like this I mean yeah there would be it would be rustic it would be frontiersy you know but uh, come on do, do you really want your kids to grow up in something like this I mean, think about it. No wonder she went running away. I mean, hell, this is in better shape than some of the stuff in, uh, Oh, okay. just can't sit around and drink other people's stuff. That's rude. Mr. Nakano. Have you finished your investigation? Did you find anything? I think I know where Kasumi went. A place called Far Harbor. She went that far up north? God, that explains why she took the boat. There's no time to waste. You have to go after her. Wait, did you find out why she left, Detective? Who she was speaking to? What does it matter? Because I know my daughter, and if she didn't tell us where she went, then she had a reason. Don't you want to know if she wants to be found? You're right, Detective. Did you find any clue to why Kasumi left home? I need to ask you an important question. <laughs> are you sure your daughter is human? What kind of question is that? Why are you asking? Your daughter made contact with a group of synths. She thinks she's one of them. What? That's... that's crazy. She's not a synth. She's a daughter. Me. We raised her. I... I gave birth to her. She's flesh and blood, not a synthetic. It doesn't matter if your daughter is a synth, Mrs. Nakano. She's still a person who needs help. But my daughter isn't a synth. This is what I was afraid of. Someone twisting my daughter's mind. You have to get to Far Harbor. Take my ship on the dock. It has a guidance system, a final gift from her father. And it's built for distance. 
What can I expect out there, Kenji? I only made the trip to Far Harbor <laughs> when I was a boy. All I remember is that my father did not want to stay long. Something about the air being bad. I'll get to the bottom of this, Kenji. Thank you. I know you haven't asked for a payment, and we can't offer much. But please, please take it. I insist. For expenses, if nothing else. No! This rain is gonna ruin my notes! <laughs> oh, pipe! Good lord! God! God, Piper! Just kicking stuff around like that, what the hell? Not how I wanted to spend the Christmas season, mind you. Oh, Piper, I can't take you anywhere. You just kick stuff over. actually a fun area um, you know we will continue the uh, Kasumi case the uh, Nakano case here soon but um, not just yet God. Hey there. Are you lost? This is Far Harbor. We, uh, we don't get many visitors around here. We don't need no freeloaders or more help, Mainlander. So you can get back in your boat and leave. Alan, this isn't your dock. It belongs to the whole town. And that means strangers are welcome. Uh, sorry, you've caught us during a, a difficult time. Uh, but Alan's got a point. Not all visitors have good intentions. So, uh, what's your business here? I need information about a synth refuge on this island. Ah, another Commonwealth traveler looking for Acadia, then. Damn it. Mariners ain't coming. Something's coming from the fog! You, help us defend the town, and I'll answer any questions you have. Uh, okay. There's a post at the top of the wall, near the main gate. The hall never lets us down. Now follow me! Okay. Be careful on the hull, stranger. Don't fall off. If you do, we might not be able to rescue you in time. Man the hull. Something's out there. You sure you saw something? This ain't a drill. All right. I peeled everyone. The gate. Open the gate. I've got wounded out here. There's no time. Look to the fog. They're coming. Gophers. Oh God. Defend yourselves. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Ah. 
What's the fog? A really good movie by John Carpenter. The fog and the remake was pretty right? decent too. But there are pockets of it, the deep fog, that are hard fallout. And as deadly as that is, that's only part of the problem. Things live in the fog, thrive. You think what attacked the harbor's bad? Oh, there's far worse further inland. If you manage to survive despite all that, you must be tough. <laughs> Ornery, more like. I just... I'm done cowering behind your damn hull, Avery. Time you let me deal with the real problem. With the right people and my guns, I can end those children of Adam cultists for good. The fog's been here forever. The children didn't make it. Before the rat eaters came, the fog was under control. They come, and it all goes wrong. It's time we do something. No need to burden a stranger with all this nonsense. <clears throat> Have the children made the fog worse? Absolutely not. There's not one bit of evidence. Geiger counters don't lie, Avery. The fog's gotten more lethal year over year. And now the fog's covering the whole island. But only after the children came. You know as well as I do, that's happened before. Sure, people have theories the children are involved, but no one, and I mean no one, has proof. So what's the deal with the children of Adam? They're religious folk. They worship the power of Adam, which is radiation. Uh -huh. If you want details, you'd have to find and ask them. We used to have a peace with them until a certain hothead menace named Alan Lee. Now that's enough. That preacher came into the harbor saying that it was Adam's will that we lost our land. It was Adam's goddamn will that we lost so many friends and family. And that the Adam would wipe this whole place clean of us. If it were up to me, you'd hang for what you did to that preacher, Alan. Oh, wow. What did he do to the preacher? Alan pulled a gun on him. He claims the preacher reached for his. We don't have police, or really any law, just custom and popular sentiment. And after everything the preacher said, it was abundantly clear doing anything to Alan would have made matters worse. <laughs> Get back to business. Sorry for all that. You're headed for Acadia, right? Getting there will be dangerous. You'll need a guide. Old Longfellow. No one knows the fog like him. But a uh, word of warning, he's a bit of an acquired taste. Thanks for the info. Best place to look for Longfellow's at the bar. The last plank. And, uh, please, lend a hand around town if you're able. 
even if it's slapped away people like the mariner and cassie and others need help and let me say something you might not hear again thank you all right trying to kill us all drive us into the ocean all right Ooh. Oh. Okay. Right now, I just... Oh, there we go. Alright. Well, we just certainly found a lot of interesting stuff about this place. And, uh... Yeah. Coming back to it. Wait a second. This must be
Okay. We'll take his boat back later. <laughs> fun. Oh, where's drummer? No drummer boy? Oh, there's a goddamn first. Oh, she's back here. Things are quiet for now. There's Demona. Randolph reports they got another synth to safety. That's two assists in your column. Another job done. Pam's near 100% on Randolph. Her best guess is our people weren't infiltrated. But the station could be compromised any time now. So keep helping Mr. Timms. Okay. I guess that's it. Up there, assume you're being one. Always. Always. You really walk the freedom trail by yourself. Pretty much. Okay, let's actually let's go home. And it is December first, everyone. Christmas. <laughs> oh, they got the Christmas lights up. Yeah, now that's kind of cool. There we go. We got Christmas lights up. Okay, and we got Christmas trees all over the place. You shoot people, uh, My dad says outside is two people. You want to find out, kid? Uh, Takahashi doesn't have a, um... I was kind of expecting him to have a, um... Uh, Santa hat on, but no, no. Alright. Okay, everyone. Shopping at night? Diamond City surplus is always open. Well, everyone, thanks for watching. I hope you had a good time. And, uh, hope to see you all again real soon. I'm not supposed well, to talk to people I don't know. Then don't talk to me. And, Piper, what do you... I just don't know about her sometimes. Okay, everyone, thanks for watching. Uh, hope to see you all again soon. Be seeing you. Piper, are you done? You're definitely getting a coal in the stocking this Christmas.